this was this was one of the um, this is one of the reports. This details the tests that they all had, the tests that they both had. Um, and this was the um, report that was very much more enthusiastic than the Lancet because it said that doctors now say we have been unable to prove that any man took part in the creation of our child, uh, this child, and all our results are consistent with a virgin birth. The doctors had been unable to disprove that that this was possible, um, and that this hadn't happened in humans. Um, you know, there was a lot of. Um, public discussion around this in the newspapers at the time and some people said you shouldn't publish this in the newspaper because children might read it and the response was any child who'd be reading a tabloid should know about the facts of life so you know that's fine and this is a Catholic this is a Catholic church I think it's a magazine called the universe which is a Catholic publication and they have published a 450 word um, response within which it was because one of the ideas was we can't say that a, a human is a virgin mother because if we did that would completely undermine the basis of uh, Jesus being a virgin, a born of a virgin mother. And, and this is what they said. They said it's um, it's not entirely unknown in the economy of nature. You know, we know that animals can do it. And and um, <laughs> I like this line. If um, you know, would it have been difficult for God to bring about the birth of his only begotten son in a parthenogenetic manner? And I love this because it's, it's like the church tying up their religion with science here. They're saying, yeah, science has proven this, so you know, God can do this too.